Good morning, I'm Tim V. And I'm Lara V, and you're watching War TV. We have a jam-packed show for you this week, starting with highlights from the Key Club Benefit as well as the AFS Kansas Exchange trip. And later, we join Mr. Flynn and the Irish Society in their celebration of the Celtic New Year. Stay tuned. <laughs> Staples away game, let's go, we're gonna be late. Yeah, real funny, guys. <laughs> come on, uh, alright, let's go, alright. You guys gotta be kidding me right now. Come on, come on, we're, we're gonna be joking. late, let's go. We have the Staples game to go to. Come on, Open the door! That was the last time, come on. Sight. Hey, you guys. Not again. See, I'm back again. I got class again. Man, I miss my friends. We gon' do it again. It's been a hell of a summer. It's been a hell of a summer. See, I'm back again. I got class again. Man, I miss my friends. We gon' do it again. It's been a hell of a summer. Hi, I'm Sam Nolan, and I'm vice president of our AFS club. Our AFS club traveled to Goodland, Kansas on November 3rd for five days. While there, we experience similarities and differences between our cultures. Their town is comprised of about 5,000 people with 250 students enrolled in the local high school. The town was an agricultural-based region. Some of our students lived with hosts who lived on these corn, wheat, or buffalo farms. Almost everyone works in the local agricultural factory or farm. Come fall harvest, everyone is busy helping out. Compared to Fairfield, Goodland is actually larger because of its farmland, however, it has a significantly lower population. And the lack of the stores we have here, they don't have Dunkin' Donuts. To sum it all up, our favorite experiences include the buffalo farm, eating potluck dinners, running through the fields, and getting to know everyone. We expect to have our host brothers and sisters here in Fairfield sometime in March. Presidents Heather Monty and Annie Ionazzi organized a program connecting the ancient Celtic New Year to the modern tradition of Halloween. Irish fiddling and traditional music was played by Grace Kim, Christian Gartland, Tong Liu, and Natalie Kais. President Monty read an overview of the program and hosted Irish soda bread and cupcakes by Hallie's Cakes were provided as refreshment. If you have an interest in joining our group, visit us a week in F5. Welcome back. You're watching Ward TV. Today, we have an exclusive interview with the football captains discussing the upcoming and highly anticipated battle against Ludlow on Thanksgiving Day. Also, we talk with Cynthia Davis from the Sudan Canvas Project about the organization's upcoming silent auction. And after, we have two ads, one regarding the Trends Boutique and the other inviting you all to this weekend's play, Flowers for Algernon. Finally, our question of the week. What are you thankful for?
Hi, my name is Cynthia Davis and I'm the founder of the Sudan Canvas Project. The Sudan Canvas Project is taking place at the Fairfield Arts Center on November 27th from 4 to 7 p.m. And it's an event where artists from all over Connecticut and even more from around the country are uniting to paint about the women of Sudan. South Sudan became a new country on July 9th and is now a sovereign new nation. And we are trying to raise awareness for the new freedom of the women and their wonderful lives and celebrating them, as well as raising awareness for the genocides and the atrocities that have taken place for decades there. All of the paintings are going to be available for auction. They're all fabulous, as well as many auction items that are going to be available from local um, retailers in Fairfield. So we hope you'll come out, come to the event, um, celebrate the women of Sudan, and support this wonderful cause. Thank you so much. The question of the week is, what are you thankful for? Isn't it obvious? Ward Crew Neck sweatshirts, available now in F11. What are you thankful for? Being Jewish. I'm thankful for FWHS librarians. What are you thankful for? I'm thankful for my mommy. And my daddy. <laughs> Toad's Place. My hat. Waffles. I'm thankful for Miss McIntosh. What are you thankful for? Uh, my friends and family. War TV. Question of the week is, what are you thankful for? All right, good answer. For all my friends. Andrew Starkey. Well, unfortunately, that's all the time we've got. Don't forget to see my brother, as well as my lovely co-host, and your fellow students perform in the Frateroli directed play tonight at 8. Enjoy your weekend, Ward. I'm Tim V. And I'm Lara V. And, and happy, happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving.